Hi Life Church, I want to talk to you today about being connected. I want to say like we're being connected and who we're connected through and that's Jesus. You know, he says that he's crafted us and he's bind us together. And uh, it's easy sometimes to get these different ideas and to, to think that we're okay, especially after we've been saved because we tend to think that like for some reason, we tend to think, oh, we're saved, we're good. And we don't tend to think about what God has for us. And so we tend to make decisions on our own rather than falling on what he has for us. And so I want to read to you guys Ephesians 4, 2 through 4. And it says, always be hum humble and gentle. Uh, gentle. Be patient with each other, making allowances for each other's faults because of your love. Make every effort to keep yourself united in the spirit, binding yourselves together with peace. For there is only one body and one spirit, just as you have been called to one glorious hope for the future. And when we talk about that and like being humble is really not like the word that, that a lot of us have described in the past. Like a lot of times we think that it means being shy or standoffish. And really what being humble means is being submissive to what God has planned for you, to what God has called you into. And so when you start to take those steps and follow what God has for you in life, you're, you're starting to be humble in that moment. And when you're humble in that moment, you start to take on what Jesus has for you. And when you start to do that, we start to, to, to develop ourselves as Christians and start to make the choices that God has for us. And then we start to walk in love towards each other because we start to see each other the way that Christ sees us. And we start to see each other through what Jesus, the way that Jesus sees each other. And then we can start walking together, as it's saying here in these scriptures, as we walk in peace with one another. And we start to give each other the grace that we need. And when we do that, we start, to, we start to come together and we start to focus and be who we're supposed to be as Christians. So I just want to share that with you today and thanks for joining me.